Good evening, everyone. My name is Kimia Jamshid, tambu player and cellist based in the DC area. And I'm so happy to be part of the District New Music Coalition concert series. I want to thank the DNMC team for making this possible and the amazing Emily Hensley for his spectacular videography. The first instrument you'll hear is called tanbur and is from the western region of Iran, also known as Kermansha. It has been said that it dates back to 3rd century AD, but it's probably older than that. This instrument was traditionally played in spiritual settings and ceremonies by an old spiritual group called Yarasan, and tambur is still being traditionally performed for spiritual purposes. The folk tunes that they perform are called maghams, and each of these maghams have specific roles and occasions. It wasn't until 40 years ago that my teacher and maestro, Maestro Kejos Rupunaziri, brought this instrument to the concert stages and began writing new pieces of music for it. And it was only about 20 years ago that a woman was able to go on stage with tambour, thanks to Maestro Rupunaziri. The piece I'll be playing for you is based on some of the maghams that I mentioned earlier and is called Saurkhani. The portion of this piece I'll perform for you is taken from a longer improvised performance uh, by my teacher Sohra Punazeri, who is the pioneer of new techniques and colors on the tanbur, and I'm honored to be playing this groundbreaking music for you. Hope you enjoy it.
the next piece I'll be playing for you is a solo cello piece by Shahal Paranj, um, who is an Iranian-born contemporary concert music composer and instrumentalist based in Los Angeles. Known as a toneback virtuoso, he has played, recorded, and collaborated with many highly respected artists and has performed in many festivals and venues around the world. In his works, Paranj blends Persian rhythmic and melodic influences with Western texture and form. This piece is called Avazajan, which is a four-movement solo cello piece inspired by Persian classical music, or radif, and um, also tambur, which you saw earlier. In the first movement, Avazajan, the cello is imitating Persian classical singing melisma, or tahrir, which is a combination of actual and fake notes, similar to nightingale singing. In the second movement, Avaz, the performer expands the pizzicato technique inspired by tambur and flamenco guitar. The third movement is called Segah, which is based on the traditional modal system of Iranian music, also known as Dastgah. What the composer has aimed to accomplish with this movement is not necessarily the specific melodies associated with this particular Dastgah, but more so the atmosphere and the harmonies, which requires the tuning of the cello to be lowered to quarter tones. The goal of this movement is to have the audience both hear and visualize the atmosphere of this Dastgah similar to when we walk into a grand cathedral or mosque and take in the atmosphere as a whole and find fascination in its beauty rather than noticing every single detail. The last movement, Shah Rashub, explores the dance music from the western part of Iran.